All right, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the Adobe Photoshop Masterclass course, bringing you from beginner to intermediate. Right now, we're going to be breaking down working with multiple images. So, I want to showcase you guys how to maneuver back and forth between multiple documents. And at the top is essentially where you're seeing them start to stack up. We've got the ASAP Ferg image from when I shot the club that we were just doing a couple experiments with and, and demonstrations with. And we've got our, you know, our sample that we created just for show basically right off the start and we're gonna do more on this this sample that we've created right here later down the road but first off what I want to do is I want to open up a few more different files and I want to showcase you guys how to navigate between so essentially if we go up here to file we open some more stuff we can actually go ahead and um, open this right here which is very fashion this right here is a logo concept I was working on for a brand and we also have the ASAP Ferg up here and the normal image and as you see right there as I showcased you the various different projects we have open that was the navigating between multiple images now it gets more complicated when we want to uh, import stuff or uh, more importantly import a certain section of an image but overall the actual um, maneuvering between multiple images is as simple as opening multiple projects and clicking between them up here now what you also have available is the zoom all windows so to go back to navigation what we could do is if we zoom out on everything that is zoomed out on everything so if we are working on a bigger project and we want to have a bigger look the zoom all windows just to re return to the navigation side of stuff is something that is very applicable now I'm gonna turn that off because I want to actually go in adjust on on the uh, the separate images themselves however the overall maneuvering between different images is as simple as loading up different projects up here and clicking between them now to import a certain section of an image into another image is also very very simple and the fact of the matter is is once you import an image from or import a a file if you will from uh, project a or document a to document B it actually becomes embedded in the second project which means that even if you close down your initial document that you imported it from it will become a part of the second document for example we can test this out here perfectly with the very fashion text now this is the first time we are revealing what a transparent background means which means that if we were to export this it would just be the text on its own and it could be put onto any other image or any other video and there would be just the text it would not have any background alternatively you see there is a white background here which means if we had the text over this first off it's white it wouldn't show up but if we had black text over this and exported it it would have a white background whereas the transparent checkered background basically is a universal symbol for there's no background but if we want to report an image it's as simple as clicking an element clicking and holding an element of document a which we're gonna call this one here and dragging it up while staying holding it into document B and coming down and letting go and you'll know that it was importing right there because if I simply delete it and we come back here um, and as you see it doesn't take it from document a and bring it to document B it 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 simply copies it but as you see the universal symbol for knowing it's coming over it's dragging it up here and we see that the plus appears right next to the cursor we can let it go and just like that, we have the words very fashion right here at the bottom, which is actually not very applicable to our image here at all of our of our performer who's who's performing in the club. However, that is as simple as that. And as you're about to see right now, if we go here, and we actually click the the uh, the cross and we chop it out. The words very fashion are part of this particular image right here and what we've also started to reveal guys is our second layer so you know how I said what what layers were gonna look like is they were gonna stack up right here you're now seeing that a little bit closer and firsthand and you're also seeing how this right here had the transparent background which means that we were able to simply drag and drop it and just like that we've put it here and we are able to continue cracking on but for the time being I'm actually just gonna go ahead and delete that get it gone and we have covered Maneuvering between multiple documents, a.k.a. multiple images. Let's keep cracking with the course.